doing today? How is everybody doing today? Thank you for sharing, guys. Thank you for sharing, guys. If you are just coming into the room because your friends invited you to the room, thank them. Thank them. I'm doing good. Thank them because I am about to give you the business today. We need to talk about money. I want to talk about money. I want to talk about money in a sense of adding additional income revenues to what you already have going on. Um, get the plug, girl. You do not want to miss this. Get the plug. We are, have, we are talking about money today because money is important. And I'm so tired of seeing my service providers my fashion, my beauty bloggers. Oh my God, this is especially for you. If you know beauty bloggers, I need you to get them in. So I'm going to get started because I know my replay viewers are impatient and they are going to want this information. So if you have never met me before, my name is Kay Whitaker and I am the owner and principal designer at Kay Whitaker Solutions, which is a branding and design studio located here in Katy, Texas. I work primarily from home when I am not officing with my staff. I have a staff of about five graphic designers that work for me that are able to help me get my workflow done. And then I also have some social media marketers on, on staff as well. But the basis of what I do while I'm here on Periscope is to make sure that I am developing small business owners that are in lifestyle brands and lifestyle means anything that has to do with affecting someone's life whether you're a wedding planner whether you are a florist whether you are a makeup artist hairstylist fashion stylist author speaker personal brand whomever you are i am here to make life just a little bit easier for you so that is why i'm here on the business behind the brand on periscope when i do scope because i want to make sure that you have the systems the techniques the strategies behind your business in order to make money i'm about making income that is why we are in business. We did not start this thing to be in business for free. So I want to make sure that when you are here, you're getting the most of your time and that you are getting something that you can take away with you to apply to your business day in and day out that's going to make a humongous difference in the way you do business, both online and offline. So the way my scopes work, I talk a lot about, hey lady, I talk a lot about things that happen with my clients and observations that I see. And this trash bag is driving me crazy. Hold on. Cut. And observations that I see online with people doing business online. I use social media a lot in my business. And one of the pet peeves that I have is when we use social media, we're not making, we're not making money. We just leave coins on the table and we're leaving money on the table, not intentionally, not intentionally, but because we don't understand the value of our influence and where to send people to help us make income. And that's what I want to talk about today. So before I jump into the juice of things, I know a few of you have already shared when I see hearts on the screen. When I see hearts on the screen, I am a hearts girl. I have to have hearts in order to stay engaged. So when I see hearts coming up on the screen, I know that I'm making sense. And I know that I'm providing information to you that's valuable. But outside of the hearts, I also want you to be able to take notes and good notes and be able to be in position to put the action that I'm about to give you right now into place when you get off. So make sure that if you are in position, there will be a replay. I'm not going to take this replay down, but make sure if you're in position that you've got something to write with and a pen, because today you're going to want to make sure that you get all of the information that I have for you for free here right now so that you can apply it to your business. So what is the point of today's scope? I title it, no more leaving money on the table. We are about to make our money, right? So by a show of hands or a show of hearts, how many of you on the scope right now are in a position where your service providers and everybody may not may or may not be a client but you're in a position where you're looking to add an additional stream of income to your business so that you can supplement the income that you make from your service so if that's you i want to see a hand in the comments or throw up some hearts on the screen because i want to make sure i'm talking to the right people you're in business, you've got a service that you offer, you may even have a product that you sell, but you're looking to supplement that uh, business formation services, like LLCs and stuff like that. I, I can help advise with those, but I don't do them the same. But if that's you, and I'm glad that I see a bunch of hearts coming up on the screen, I see some hands. Okay, so I'm talking to the right people. So how many of you are using social media as a way to pr promote your business? as a way to promote your business. My site is kwhitaker.com. 
How many of you that are here that are in service oriented businesses or that are looking for a way to add additional income to your business? How many of you are using social media as a way to promote your business? Show of hands are, are, are intrigued by social media as a way to promote your business. The heart stops and the hand stops. So where did y'all go? Nobody's using social media. Okay. Elegant twist. I got one and a purple heart. Nobody else. I've got some yellow hearts, some pink hearts. Okay, so there are some of you that are here that are intrigued by using social media. So how many of you, <laughs> this is one more question that will get to the good stuff. How many of you that are intrigued by using social media, you're here for business, you're looking for an additional source of income, how many of you are, are familiar with the idea of affiliate marketing, referral marketing, commission-driven sales for somebody else's product or service? I see some hearts. I don't see any hands. Give me some something. If that's you, just say, it's me in the comments. Nope, not familiar. Okay, no problem. We're going to learn today. I see some hearts on the screen. So that means somebody knows what's going on. Okay. So not a whole lot, not a whole lot of you. I saw some blue hearts. No. Okay. So here's what I want to talk about today. A little from Monetize Thyself. Okay. So you might know a little bit about this. So we're getting ready to go into this. And we're going to go a little bit into more than what Nicole talks about in the course. But when you are online as a service provider, a lot of the problems that I get, I deal with a lot of service providers. A lot of you guys are my clients and you're in service provider industries and you're trying to figure out a way to add income to your business and you don't know how to bring in products. When you're looking, affiliate marketing is this. Affiliate marketing is aligning yourself with another product or service that you can advertise and earn a commission. Now, when you say that, most times people back off of it and get scared because one, they want to protect their brand, which is totally understandable. And if that's you, I want to see some love on the screen. Two, they're not familiar with it. And when you say sales, it's just an additional headache that they have to deal with in order to add something else to their business. They got enough going on, so they're not really trying to get in anywhere else to figure out how they can add that income because they're thinking about their service, right? That's two. Or three, they're just unfamiliar with it, period. They're just unfamiliar with the peer. I don't know what that is. I'm fo I'm right here. I'm in my lane. I don't have a lot of time to be trying to think about anything else, but this is where I am, right? If that's you, show me some love on the screen. Give me something in the comments. Okay, see some hearts on the screen. All right, I see some stuff coming up. So that's where most of us are as service providers, especially as it relates to online. You know, we're here. And we know that we want to make some additional income outside of our services, but we hadn't put the dots together. Like we don't know how to connect the two. I can't figure that thing out. I have no idea how I would bring a product into my service oriented business without me developing it. And I'm not a product developer. I don't want to spend the time to do that. So how in the world do I add additional products to my services where I can make an additional source of income? And that's where we are today. That's what I want to talk about today is, talk, is figuring out a way to add products to your service so that you can make additional income. So I don't want you to leave with me on here because this is easy. This is super, super easy. So as a service provider, most of you do what? You educate your customers, right? You educate your clients, you make referrals on products that they should use, whether it's yours or somebody else's, and you tell them all about the good things that happen with other products. So for example, I'll give you an example. It is, it's like adding tea to your products, it sure is. So let me give you an example. When I got on this scope, I told you, I want you to get a notepad and a pen, right? So I suggested, that you need a notepad and a pen to take notes for this scope, right? So how great would it be if me as a service provider, you see in my notepad, you like it, you had somewhere to go for you to buy a notepad like this and maybe a pen just based off of my referral, just based off of the information that I gave you. How great would that be if, if you were referring, Elegant Twist, a tea product to your customer you had an affiliate relationship with that product or service that you could refer them to. And if they purchased that tea, you made a commission off of it. How great would that be? How easy would that be? And it's just an additional part of your conversation, right? So a lot of you, this is what you do already. 
especially my beauty bloggers y'all do it a lot like y'all youtubers you do it a lot right you on there you beating your face with your beauty blender you got your la girl cosmetics you got your brushes and stuff that you use all of these products and services and when i go to the comments there is nothing to be found as to where i could buy these products yes you post it on your website you post it everywhere but when i go to your comments there's nothing to be found as to where i could buy these products there's no link you may leave the you may leave the name of the product but there's no link directly associated with you that if i go and purchase the product you're going to earn an income on it right y'all have seen those videos y'all watch them i watch them all the time because that's how i do my makeup that's how i learn how to do my makeup by watching youtubers but how much easier would it be if there's a link in that comment that said okay visit this link by this product and by purchasing that product at that link you get paid so let's talk about that today. So there's a very simple way to get this done and incorporate this into your business strategy that doesn't take you completely out of the box, that doesn't take you completely out of your element, that doesn't make you completely uncomfortable with what you already offer. And the easiest and the simplest way to do that is through an Amazon affiliates account. So those of you that are, feel, are familiar with Amazon, how many of you on the scope that are still here, how many of you are familiar with Amazon? You familiar with Amazon? By a show of hearts and a show of hands, how many of you are familiar with Amazon? You shop on Amazon for something, uh, you know that it exists, it's, you know, the biggest, okay, you're familiar with Amazon. So if you're familiar with Amazon and you shop on Amazon, how many of your friends, family, and customers shop on Amazon? Keep the hearts coming if you know somebody that shops on Amazon, right? They're there because Amazon does what? It sells everything you can find everything on amazon from your underwear <laughs> to the shoes on your feet everything that you want in life can come from amazon correct so amazon offers what's called an affiliate program and i told you before that an affiliate is nothing more than being a referral so okay all right i got it they got that you know i can make money with that but how do i incorporate that into my business model this is how this is how any product books skincare dvds bath stuff kids toys food uh oils all kind of stuff amazon sell everything you want it go to amazon you can find it. i promise you you can find it and it's going to be for a good price they're cheaper than everywhere else so how do you incorporate that into your business model? How do you incorporate that into your business model? Okay, I have an Amazon account. I've signed up as an affiliate, but how do I incorporate that to my business model? It's easy. When you are educating your customers and you are telling your audience of people that they should do this with this product, more than likely, especially in the digital world, more than likely you are referring something that could be found on Amazon. So say for instance, you're on Periscope and we'll use me for example. And I'm gonna break this down to you. It's really gonna shock you now. So we're on Periscope and some of you, and this could have nothing to do with the business that you offer. Some of you may like my hat. Some of you may like my glasses. Some of you may like my earrings. Some of you may like my necklace, my bracelet, my shirt, my makeup, whatever, right? Now, how easy would it be if I were to come on and you say, okay, I like those glasses. Oh, you do? No problem. If you want something like that, then just visit my store on Amazon and you can purchase some. And I give you the link to the store. You go, you purchase the glasses. I make money. And it's the same thing for you. It's the same thing for you. A lot of times when I come here to Amazon, I'm suggesting books. I'm suggesting processes. I'm suggesting notebooks, paper, pen, you know. All of those things are on my website. If you go to my blog right now, you can find something on my website that's a notebook, a planner, a divider, something that has something to do with enhancing your business. And if you purchase that product, I will make an income off of that. And it works the very same for you. So if you're following me, I need to see some hearts on the screen because I want to make sure I hadn't lost you or scared you <laughs> in this process. Okay, I see hearts. So now you've got the Amazon Associate account set up right now your whole life you can monetize your whole life everything you do you can make an income off of it all you have to do is have some form of strategy now it has to make sense just like your products need to make sense but just like i come on periscope and i understand that not all of you are my customer not all of you are going to be able to sit with me independently i'm not going to be able to design your website i'm not going to be able to sit with you as a business coach i understand that i get that 
but you can spend some form of income with me by the things in Target because I don't have headphones and I refuse to log out. Exactly. When you, oh, girl, tell them. <laughs> Go to the website. <laughs> so I am every piece of my, every piece of my brand, every piece of everything that I do. The purse that's sitting behind me can be found on my website. Anything that you do, you can earn an income. That is why you're here. You have to shift your mindset. When you're in business as a service provider, we, I know what the problem is. We get so consumed, so consumed on our service and the customers that can take our service that we block off the rest of the money that we can be earning. Now, I'm not telling you that you're going to get rich on Amazon Associates. That's not what I'm saying to you. But what I am saying to you is that if you want to create passive income and you're using social media already, to educate and inform your customers, but you're not gaining anything back from it, this might be a good idea. This might be something good to incorporate into your business model so that you are getting something as a return on your investment of time into the people that are following you. It's sometimes it has nothing to do with your business, but everything to do with getting a return on the investment of time that you invest into other people. And this is a subtle way to do it without becoming overbearing and a car salesman type environment. It's just a way to add more income to what is already an income producing environment. For those of you that are still here with me, we started with what, 20, 25 people on the Periscope and there are 11 of you that are still here. That means that you're interested in some form of fashion, right? Maybe not interested in, in working with me one-on-one, -on -one. that's okay, you know, but maybe there is something that I can offer to you through this by way of directing you to an Amazon location where you can purchase those items and be it out earn off of it. So even if we never do business directly together, there is still a form of monetary value and me spending time here with you and informing you of some form of income revenue stream. Does that make sense? I hope that makes sense. Hearts on the screen if that makes sense. If it makes sense, just say I got it. Okay, I see some hearts on the screen. So in order to, the, it's so simple. <laughs> it is so incredibly easy to get this done. What presented, what are the percentages like for Amazon. So from an Amazon account, you can make anywhere from 6% to 8.5%. You can get paid off of a fixed rate or you can get paid off of volume depending on what you're selling. Now the reason why I suggest Amazon and I'm an affiliate marketer so I have accounts with Amazon, ClickBank and all, you know, JV Zeus, all types of stuff. As a service provider, and I'll use me as an example, I'm a digital media studio, so I talk a lot about social media marketing. Every tool that I use, every tool in my business that I use, if I refer it, I can make money off of it. I make sure that if I'm signing up to use a tool, that they offer an affiliate program, because if I'm going to tell somebody else about what I'm using, then I want to make sure that I can earn some form of income. So Hootsuite, I have an affiliate account with it. You know, so I believe in affiliate marketing, but I believe in smart affiliate marketing. But with Amazon, the the you can get paid anywhere from six to eight and a half percent, which is great. Like there are some other affiliate market, some other places that'll pay you up to like fifty percent on one product. Their product might be fifty, sixty bucks, but you got to work a little harder to sell that. What I'm trying to do is get you to think easy. This is the easiest way to do it. If you've never done affiliate marketing before, then this is an easy way to do it. So I'm going to give you some suggestions for those of you that are on Periscope still. So if you're in the wedding industry, Amazon pays out for wedding registries. So if you want to suggest to your brides, no, it is free to join. It is free to join. If you want to suggest wedding registry to your bride and you add Amazon in your packet that you give to your bride and say register on Amazon by following this link, every time one of your brides registers on Amazon, you earn an income. If you're doing makeup, I already talked to you on YouTube. If you're doing makeup on YouTube and you're suggesting all of these products and your videos and these blog posts, then create Amazon links to these products so that you can get paid. You have influence over your audience. So when you tell people to go and purchase something, when you tell people, you give people directive to say, okay, I use this because I like it and this is how it works and you can use it too. If you have a cleaning service, if there are cleaning products that you use in your cleaning service, there are cleaning products that you use in your cleaning service that you would suggest for a user that cannot be your customer. They're somewhere across the country. You could never service them. Create a link to that cleaning product on Amazon and send them there.
and send them there. There are so many ways that you can earn mops, brooms, spurt, yes, all of the above. Gloves, aprons, janitorial service, you know, janitorial supplies. We have a janitorial company. We have an Amazon business account. And I, you bet your bottom dollar if I am telling my customers to go and purchase products, that if they're purchasing the products and I'm not purchasing them, I'm giving them the link to my Amazon store so they can go through my store and I earn a commission every time they order their products. So when I start off customers, when we sign on new contracts, if they're, if we give them a list of what they should have and from that list we say go purchase them here and it goes directly to my Amazon account. So I still make money. I still make money. It doesn't matter what industry you're in. If you are in a place where you can refer something that's going to be of benefit to your customers, then you need to be sending them to Amazon. And the reason why I say Amazon is because Amazon is familiar. Who doesn't shop there? We said about 10 minutes ago that everybody shops on Amazon. Everybody is familiar with it. They already know it. So it's not going to be any skepticism that comes along with it when you direct them there because the platform has already established themselves. You're just the referral. So you send the business there. You earn a commission. And I don't care if it's a penny, $5, $2, you know, money is money. And you sell enough and you make enough. And now all of a sudden you've got a couple of hundred dollars coming in just because you were a referral off of people that will have never done business with you any other time. But you still get a return on your investment. And it adds up. It adds up. Easy money. Easy money. And that's just the start. You know, and I'm not telling you that's what you have to do. Go so create an Amazon store account. Yes, you do. So now, now here's the sales pitch. <laughs> here's the sales pitch. You can absolutely do this by yourself. It is that simple. You do not have to have anybody to direct you through the process. If you are tech savvy, all you have to do is go to Amazon.com and go down and say become an affiliate and it will walk you through the process. Easy peasy. But if you are not tech savvy or you want the additional help, products not on Amazon. Like what, Tiffany? Now, if you want the additional help, you want somebody to hold your hand and walk you through the process, I stayed up all night. And I'll, I'll tell you, I'm going to give you a backstory before I tell you what happened. Last night, I'm on, I'm, I'm on YouTube. I'm a YouTuber, y'all. I don't do videos, but I'm all in people's business. So last night, and I get frustrated when I see people not making money. Like, that just makes my skin crawl. I feel like if, if you are blogging, if you are on YouTube, if you are using social media, you should be making money. I don't care if it's not related to your service. You need to be making money. And I see so many makeup artists on YouTube that are not maximizing on their earning into. It just makes my stomach hurt. So last night I was on YouTube. I was on YouTube. And I was watching these videos. Beautiful girls. Beautiful girls. And I'm not going to name any names because I won't throw anybody up under the bus. But I go to their comments and I'm like, these girls got to be killing it. Like they got to know that there is opportunity here. Go to the com Nothing. It gives me a list of the products that they use, but guess what? I got to go find it on my own and give somebody else money. Now, why would I do that? Now, why does that make sense? I've sat here and watched these videos. You have schooled me and given me all of my lifetimes 10 in this video. I trust you and I believe everything that you just said. Why aren't you making money? Why aren't you making money? So that's my frustration. So here's what happened. Out of that frustration, I said, okay, I need to school some people. Clothing and retailers sometimes not found on Amazon like Zara and Mango. Okay, so if you are using Zara and Mango, what you're going to have to do, this is what I would do. This is my technique, and it's, this is what I would do. I would create an Amazon account, and I would sell other products like Zara or Mango. Sell other products. And I know that's kind of compromising, especially from people's, it depends on their budget, you know, so your lower end clients, you can find, you can probably find something that's like a Zara or Mango shirt. So you advertise that on social media, people go and buy it. You do that for long enough and you start making people, you can prove that you have influence on people. Then, then you go to Zara as a wholesaler, the Zara wholesaler and say, look, I am a fashion stylist. This is what I do. And when I talk to people, people take action. People move. I have influence on people. So I've sold this much in revenue in somebody else's product. I want to sell yours. And you need to give me a discount to my customers. And I need to earn a commission on your products. But use something like Amazon or some other service as leverage to be able to say, this is the revenue that I can bring to your brand. 
this is what I can do for you because I've proved I can do it for you because I've done it for somebody else. So if you want these type of results, then you need to make me a wholesaler of your product. You are welcome. You need to make me a wholesaler of your product and I'll bring that income to you too. So that is how I would use that. So, you know, I could talk about this forever, ever, ever, ever. So you can absolutely go start an Amazon account on your own for free. You don't need my help to do that. But if you want the extra love and attention, you can absolutely do that because I spent my night last night walking you through every step of the process creating an Amazon store. And it is on my site. The link's in my bio and it's $27. And I made it so cheap because I didn't want no excuses about y'all not being able to get this set up. For my peoples, <laughs> my peoples, I need to make sure that you have this information. And for $25, I think you can afford to go and get the course and get your hand held while walking through the store. But you don't need it. But if you want it, it's there and it's available to you. And it walks you through everything. And then on top of that, I give you some marketing techniques that help you kind of market your store as well. And there's going to be some bonuses on there as well that if you use like a WordPress site, fix the link. It's not working. Okay, hold on. Let me get my iPad. Hold on. Here we go. See, I did that. And it didn't work. Uh, it should be bit.ly forward slash K's. Capital K A E S Azon A capital A Z O N. Hold on, let me get to Bitly and make sure I got this right. But I did this because I didn't want y'all. I didn't want y'all to be without this. Y'all needed this. Let me make sure I got it right. Hold on. K's. Oh, it says Butley. It's Bitly. I'm sorry. It's not Butley. <laughs> bit.ly forward slash case azon okay it's fixed yes it's clickable in my peri link i just fixed it so if you want the course you can go and get it it's 27 dollars, and it'll be there to walk you directly through the process it's a simple process and i think it might be an hour or two worth of information and each of the little segments are broken up into little segments so you don't have to sit there and watch a full hour or two worth of tutorials Okay, and it walks you through the exact process that you use to create the account, what type of earning potential you have, and how to market it. Just three simple ways on how to market it. And then I'm going in when we get off of this Periscope to add a bonus to the videos to say, okay, if you're a WordPress superstar and you know how to use WordPress and you're interested in e-commerce, then here's what you need to do in order to make you a full e-commerce store on your WordPress site using a plugin that will help you pull products directly from Amazon to your store to help you make more money. Something like what's on my site. It's all there. It's all there. And it's only 27 bucks in order for you to take advantage of it. So, And I want you to go get it. If you need it, if you need that kind of help, I want you to go get it because I don't want you to have any excuses as to why you're not earning extra income while you're online. Does that make sense? Does that make sense? Okay, guys.